Hey there, with this video I'll be showcasing our list filters directory add-on. As the name suggests, the add-on will allow visitors to use filters in order to reduce the number of displayed results. The add-on enables this functionality through a widget that you add inside the appropriate widget area. Filters can be shown in search pages, category pages and the all posts page. Quick tip, you can open the all posts page by adding the custom post type slug after the domain name. Ok, back to filters. The most important thing about them is the fact they don't require you to refresh the page. As you can see, I'm getting results as soon as a filter is initiated. To keep it easier to manage, the demo site contains only about 500 listings. However, we've tested the filter add-on with about 10,000 listings and the results were equally impressive. By default you'll find three filters provided by the widget, star rating, categories and miles range. Along with those, you can add your own custom fields to the widget. Another cool thing about these custom fields is the fact I can easily change their position. It's done with simple drag and drop within the filter widget. Let's put multi checkbox field and awesomeness scale at the top. Save the progress and check out the front end. Yep, it's all good. If you're wondering whether it's possible to show different fields in different categories, well, it is. All you need is this free widget logic plugin. With the plugin installed, add multiple instances of the filter widget inside the widget area, select different custom fields for each instance and then make them show inside different category pages. The conditional tag useful here is is underscore tags. You can expect detailed instructions on how to set this up inside the documentation guide. And as usual, thanks for watching.